What's up everybody? Today I'm going to be doing a review on the Etnies Marana Slip XLT. So let's jump right into it. So the outsole is the Michelin Collaboration outsole, which I really like. The midsole here is like an inch high, roughly. There's a nice little rubber heel cap and toe cap, which I thought was a nice touch. There's also this cool like design, I don't know if you can see, right here on the toe kind of reminds me of some of Etni's older models. Also some breathability holes here, which are pretty cool. This is a slip-on shoe, so you don't have to worry about laces, which I think is a good thing. I have problems with my laces shredding on the other shoes I usually skate, so that's a positive thing. The fact that it's all suede is really nice because it makes them durable. You can see a little bit of abrasion here from my first session, but overall it was pretty positive. The sole is STI Lab. I don't know what that is, but pretty good, felt okay. So yeah, that's pretty much the overall design of the shoe. So I'm gonna get into a few negatives. I was going over these clips and I realized I didn't really say anything positive about the shoe before jumping right into the negatives. So some positive things about the shoe are that they hold up pretty well as far as the skating goes. Also, I think they look really good. So those are just some things. Also, they have pretty good board feel. So yeah, those are the positive things about the shoe. Anyway, back to the video. The first negative is that they run a little big, like a half size big. So I wear an 11 and a half. If you wear whatever size you wear, just go a half size lower from that. So realistically, I probably should have gotten 11s but i didn't know they were going to run a little big it's not completely detrimental but it would definitely help if i knew that before i bought them the other negative thing it's on the other shoe so i know this is probably a manufacturing fluke but i did want to address it and that is that the elastic on this shoe like completely came undone and this didn't happen while i was skating it actually happened before i was skating when i pulled up I guess the tongue of the shoe to put it on it just like pulled apart and the elastic didn't rip it was the stitching right here that just pulled out so at knees if you're watching this this isn't supposed to be like a hit piece or anything like i actually thought they skated pretty good i pretty much bought the first run of this shoe but yeah that's probably the only issue i had with them aside from the fact that they run a little big but yeah overall i think the shoe has a lot of potential and uh, I'll be looking forward to hearing what other people think about it. Anyway, here are some clips of me skating it. Thank you. 